with the shit. Hey, 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 I am a king. I, 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 I am a king. I, 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 I am a king. I, 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 I am a king. I, I, this is all done. This is sex to the beach. I'm not gonna get low. Guys, this is your King and I visit Phantom EX Turk, and we're gonna be reacting to some cringe message board stuff. We're gonna be, we're gonna be trolling and cells today, and doing dramatic reading of their message boards, and probably try to figure out what I could do to make their dating life a lot better. I mean, I want to help everybody. And I think everybody deserves a second chance to change their ways. Starting with... Oh, oh great. We're starting with a shooter. Named Malik Minison. Alright, here we go. Private re... re was it? Recruitment. History. Infirmary. And infantry. Wishing to speak to F Sergeant 4chan, please. C-2349-161, the incel rebellion has begun. We will overthrow the chads and Stacy's. All oh, hell, Supreme. I'm, I'm, it's not Supreme, gentlemen. Supreme Leader, Elliot Rogers. Well, there's probably a reason why you're not getting uh, many dates, my, my friend. You realize Elliot Rogers is kind of an infamous figure for good reasons. Oh, but that's right. Never mind. You did the same thing. Oh. Yep, no, no saving to you. Well, you ain't gonna be seeing St. Peter or being in the new system or whatever. It looks like you're going below, but just saying, you little rebellion. You just created pretty much what I call white ISIS. Let's get to the next one. What? What's a roasty? It's a libel. <laughs> it's a line building that looks like roast beef flaps because it has been destroyed by many chads. Since all females slut up with chad, they're all disgusting roasties. Oh, the top of the roast beef thing. The roast beef pussy. Wow, you're out of, you're out of the loop, my friend. Yeah, that's a bad thing. Wait a minute, now I think about it. I'm kind of offended that pussy's slang for those bloody roast beef tacos that they have, which you'll never get, but they ain't going to associate with lovely female friends of female friends at the same time, please. Um, um, what's this one? To make a cat happy, you also need to be its. Beta books, though he doesn't care, but he just he can get money, get money he can from you. I'm pretty sure cats are afraid of these dudes. Let's go on. Foyt, Foyt's at work and directly asking me to. I'm not gonna write the rest of it. That's too disturbing. You'll see it when I put it up on the video. But I'm not gonna recite that. I'm not. I don't recite the. We don't recite. We don't recite the satanic chat in this house mm -mm. we we bar that so and that's what that is okay read the rest the foids at work wearing a summer dress love the pin over to my other desk when looking at someone else's motor sometimes i turn around and tight glutes of the foids stretch her dress and pants FFS, this is fucking sexual harassment. I want to fucking slap those butts. Rape! And insert my. F did. No, wait, wait. Did, am, am I reading this right? Am I reading. <laughs> did he say I insert my 4.4? Okay. Okay, probably should have left that out. No, I'm just gonna say that. I'm gonna be honest. That's the stuff you lie about. You know, act like it's huge. Act like you're a big bodybuilder Chad who has at least seven to eight inches. Four, uh, don't put this on there, please. Don't post, even on a message board, because then people like me have to roast you to understand. Don't put that in there. Come on, man. This is probably what's making you suffer. But four inch pen or hopefully to get, get some tight. Who's season?
You know, you ain't getting nothing. You just out yourself. You just told everyone your business. Don't do that. Okay, things never to tell people online is the size of your thing, your um, your income, your income, your work history, your relationships in the past. Um, it, it, it's stuff like that. Never tell, or even if I be, even if you have illegitimate, illegitimate children, just just don't. Just okay. We're gonna go. I had a food in my elevator. She when she got out, she had a box in her arms and another box on the floor. And she tried to move the box out with her foot and got stuck in the elevator on the ledge. She almost tripped and she had paused to think about what was she going to do then. Put the box in her arms on the floor, walk back and pick the other wish list. I stared at her and looked at her like she's an idiot. Fucking dumb bitch. Hurry up. Well, see if she tripped on the elevator, shouldn't the best, it shouldn't the thing to do to, is to help her up. It's not simping to help people up when, you know, when they drop stuff. It's kind, it's it's kind of being courteous, you know. And telling her to hurry up is probably making you think so, making your day life suffer. Look, I'm not saying be nicey nice and Mr. Sunshine. And be a simp, but you know, if someone's you know going through some stuff, you know, or at least you know tripped and fall and, and dropped their stuff. Maybe the best thing you might want to do is help them up. I'm just saying, instead of tell them to hurry up. You know, I'm I'm starting to think I I, I can't save these souls. Saint Peter can't save these souls. It's it's this is. Yeah, let's skip to the next one. For you. No, instead they make fun and ridicule us. Like we already have been our entire lives. And you have control over this a little bit. They screenshot our posts that they're obvious cries for help. Things we're saying out, out of absolution, desperation, and anger is something we have no control over. Oh, I beg to differ. Yeah, you do. It's how about just not do that? How about just not get angry at them or at least get angry offline? You know, punch a pillow, go punch a punching bag, go to the gym and work off that anger or listen to some really hard, hard, heavy metal and then come back after you got all out of your system. So, yeah, probably want to. Do probably want to do everything else besides post angry stuff. That's probably why this screenshot embarrass you, bud. And then you get roasted. You have control over what you do. They will never be able to understand how absolutely fucking horrible some of our lives, and yet they continue to push us over the edge. Crawling in my skin, these wounds they will not heal. Uh, the, the saddest part is when someone finally sn does snap and does something horrible. They ask, how could someone do this? I guess they probably block it out for a good reason. He's probably put a threat. And this is why the cop... Then not only you're getting roasted, bud, but you're also going to get the cops on you. You just pretty much threaten people. Just just saying, bud. You might, see, that's this is why... This is why you ain't getting nowhere with any females, let alone, and, and people, and this is why people make fun of you. Look, I'm not the best poster. I post emotional shit, too, but this level of stuff is, it, it, you're just outing yourself out to be a pathetic loser who's angry and desperate for attention. I'm just saying, you, you look like an attention whore who's also emo that things ain't going your way and women ain't giving you no time of day, but... You put this on the internet, bud. What are you doing? And then you uh, and then you put something that's incriminating. <sighs> so yeah, I think that was the last one. I only got like five of these, but I wanted to try some new content. So you know, this has been the roast of the incel message board communities, and try to improve yourself. You know. That'd be a better thing, you know, and, uh, and look, 
we all fall in that. We all think about girls. Let's be honest. We all do. But if you put that same energy into actually, you know, your hobbies, your gym workout, the better you would be. You know, you know, I've kind of fell into this, and I'm not exactly like this, but I fell into a category where I thought about nothing but women and try to impress them and try to do everything in my means to get their attention. And I'm telling you right now, the less you think about this stuff, the better chance you got. Look, I'm not saying I'm a master player of the game. In fact, I'm still socially awkward. But I have better chance than some of these guys. Because look at the posts. You know, I like they don't have no control. Yeah, you kind of do, bud. You kind of do. Take some responsibility. So this has been the Roast of the Incel. Message board, community, and dramatic rings. I'm going to crystal be with you. We're also working. Vincent Valentine web series um, fan trailer at least so please support JTS productions if you want to see a Vincent Valentine you know trailer and then hopefully one day it becomes a web series so there's that too